Okay, hi guys, and welcome back to the Memory of Alderim um, from Eliminal Games. Um, I just booted up the game just a second, um, and I'm going to go through some of the changes since the last time we played. As you can see from the bottom left, there is now a small type of inventory quick access system. Um, the only thing I have equipped is a health potion, which is on Q, and if you press it, you can see the green bar disappears and slowly regenerates over time. And that will give you a small health boost if you're losing health. Um, other things have been improved. The normal sword has been reduced in size um, to make it look a bit nicer. And also, the best feature that I can find that's been added is this. We now have a dodge, duck and roll type system. And it's, it's very, very useful for combat. Extremely useful for combat. Um, it takes up a bit of your stamina to use, as you can see the green bar at the bottom is being decreased as I roll about. And for me, it's absolutely awesome. I love this new feature. Especially the little jump back, I use it a lot when attacking people. Okay, so... Um, the graphics look slightly better to me as well. I don't know if that's because it's been a while since I booted up the game. Um, but for me, it looks nicer. It does look a lot nicer. Um, yeah. Let's have a look at look in the houses actually, see if there's anything changed inside. No, there's still still the bare bones of houses, but you know, they look nice inside. The lighting's pretty cool. The lighting's very nice actually. Really am a big fan of the lighting. Um these I've learned recently now that these two guards are elderly and they are my friends. As you can see, we're very similarly dressed. Um and I'm pretty sure that guy there is an enemy, and if I attack him, which I'm going to do with my fireball. He'll come running, and hopefully these two guys will actually help me. Hey, there we go. Oh, crap. I say that, but, uh... Okay, I got this. That's it. I'll take him from the back, you two take him from the front. Okay, and now he's down. Other things that have changed are you now... Um... See that the maces... So last time I was in trouble picking up the maces, then now all the loot is on the dead person. So you just loot their corpse, as it were, to get the items. This guy had something special. These here, the pants, are apparently special items. So I'm going to equip them straight off the bat. Um, helmet, I'm going to put that on. Um, is this any better? I'm rank 3, mine's 4. So you get, you get a nice instant cross-reference of what your armor type is and what their armor type is at the top there. Mine's actually better, but theirs is more expensive, so I'm going to take that so I can sell it. Um, my shield is not as good as theirs. So I'm going to put my old wooden shield down there, and the boots. Let's look at the boots. Um, not as good, and they're worth less as well, so this guy's all rubbish, really. Um, let's look at my helmet, very nice. I've not worked out if you can spin round your character yet. I don't think you can. He's still looking like he's got something special on him, but I don't think he does. Um, and it's uh, apparently now daytime, which is interesting. Okay, and I worked out earlier as well. If I press K, yes, if I press K, my current skills appear. As you can see, I am awful at everything. Which is a uh, very fitting, really, because I am pretty much awful at everything. Hi. So, let's uh, take another wander out into the wilderness and see what trouble we can discover. And take a nice look at the memory of Elid Elid Elderim. Elderim. I keep saying the name wrong, I really do. Um, I keep saying Elidium, which, in all fairness, is... Whoa! Not a good a name as the actual name is called. It, it's the memory of Alderim, um, and it's a very—it's actually a really cool sounding name. Whereas the name I keep giving it's not. God, this guy's not dying. Ugh. Using the new dodge feature there. Oh, to jump back from the attacks. The uh, AI is a lot more animated in their attacks as well. It seems. Come on, roll, 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 roll. I went to roll. Ugh. There we go. I don't know why I'm doing this on my own. I could just uh, lure him back. There we go. He's dead. And he barely hit me, actually. A little tool there. That's quite cool. Um, his sword seems to be quite nice. 4, 4.2. Switch it over. Um, 
shield. Apparently he had some highly armored pants again. I don't know why people have highly armored pants. It's uh, a little odd. You know. Anyway, I come trousers. <laughs> Still, do like the lighting in the game. It's very nice. The shadows look awesome. If you know from Skyrim and stuff, the shadows in Skyrim are very pixelated. These look very nice. Very impressed at that. Okay, let's take a look and see if any of the in-game settings have changed. I'm just going to change the sound settings slightly. Because, uh... The music for me was very loud. Yes. I don't know how quiet this is now going to be, but we'll find out. Yeah, sounds pretty nice on the uh, sword. Let's see if we can get a high vantage point. Still no sneak feature, I don't think. Can't seem to find it, um, which is not a problem. But I'm under. Oh, there it is. <sighs> combat music is a nice indicator to tell you whether you're in combat or not. <sighs> oh god, this guy is going down. Seriously going down. Come on, come on, come on. Die, please die. Yes. Haha. <laughs> Okay, what did you have? Ah, oh, no wonder he died, he had worse stuff than me. What's my mace like? 5.9, he's 7.5. Oh, let's get it. What's my sword actually? Should I, uh. I'm gonna switch to mace. I didn't get to use it much last time. Um, if you've watched the first video, um, I got the mace out, took on four people, and died. Um, it wasn't the most graceful of deaths either. Um, and it was a bit stupid of me, really, to be honest. I wasn't ready to stop playing at that point either. I wanted to continue. This guy's. Oh, you see me, you see me, you see me. <sighs> ah, that's gonna hurt. Let's see if Q works for quick potion. It did. Boosted my health a little bit. Whoa. Let's use F for fiery touch. <laughs> oh, that's getting me hit though. Ah. I'm dying, seriously, yeah. Get hit. Whew. That was quick. So if I press Q now, see my health just boost a very little jump from about here to there um, when I press Q. So you can see how it works. Ooh, I'm ranking on the shields. Oh, that's the same as that one. Helmets. Cool. Very nice. I can't wait till they get in the inventory like the actual representation of what they look like on your character. That'd be cool. Um, very nice. Oh, there's a guy. Is it just one or two? Let's get a bit of high ground on him. Just one at the moment. Let's jump up here. Can I jump up here? I can jump up here. Nice. Just one. That's literally basically what I do in this game. Is I, <laughs> I walk around and uh, attack people before they see me. Well, oh, this guy is getting pummeled before he's even turned around. Let's put him out of his misery. You're on fire! Oh, I did that! I did that! How did I do that? How did I do that? How did I do that? Oh, I've worked out to do that! Ha ha ha! And I'm not going to tell anybody! Because it's my special move! Hey, stop doing it! Oh, no! <laughs> well, I think I was a little bit too happy that I worked out how to do that move. If anyone's interested, it's simply forward, sprint, and attack at the same time. Who would have thunk it, eh? There is combos. The sun is setting very quickly. That looks so cool, apart from the blue of the sun. That looks mint. It's very nice. Um, how do I restart? Oh, by clicking attack. And the sword to pick up straight at the start. Okay. Um, so I've started off again with all my equipment that I just died with, so you see I've got the mace. Um, I've got everything that I just had. You know, it's, it's pretty alpha, it doesn't take any think away from you, it just wants you to enjoy the game and see what it looks like. And uh, it's very fun, to be honest. It's very, very fun. Um, I'm going to take a different path this time. I haven't looked over to this side. I'm going to take a look at the foliage. Very nice looking bushes. Ah! That's a big bush. What's this? Hey! Oh, new enemies that I have not faced yet. Skeletons. Let's take a look at these boys. Um, oh god! They're moving. They are fast skeletons. 
Ah! Step back, skeleton warrior. You're no match for me. With my mace. Oh god, they do it. Oh, I'm running out. Let's keep walking backwards. Oh god. He's nearly dead. Kill him. Kill him. Oh, nice. Oh, who are you? Why are you not fighting the skeletons? You got such a. Ah, the old man is killing me. I need help. Back off a little bit and... Oh, I missed. Huh. 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 Ah, I got a bit of him then. And he's down. Can you loot the skeletons? You can. They just have basically rubbish weapons on them. Now, where is that old man with his beard? I'll take some health. I'll try and show you that health for definite this time as well. I did it a bit quickly last time. Wait for the health. Right, so I've got a health potion. I'm an 87. Press it, 101. There you go. You can see the jump up there. So the health potions do work, and they work quite nicely. Um, it's a bit of a cheat that you get it regenerating over time, but again, pre-alpha. So take it for granted. Or take it or leave it. Oh, 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 a chest, a chest, a chest. I've not found a chest yet in this game. Oh, what's this? An axe. Taking that. Um, I also got a message off the developer of the game, which was nice on my uh, YouTube video last time and uh, apparently they are looking to add double clicking items to add them to your inventory which is awesome and that's really cool for them checking that video out so cheers guys for watching that video that's really cool I feel actually dead chuffed <laughs> not only that I'm having a serious amount of fun in this game oh who's that I just literally like walking around seeing who these people are and trying to kill them oh god you nearly scared me. Ah! I should block more. Ooh. Okay, my blocking's rubbish. I'm going to see in a minute if I'm in my... Okay, let's loot him first, actually. No, I'll leave that stuff. I'm going to see if... Uh, any of my skills have improved. So, my fire is only bad now. <laughs> it's not awful anymore. So, I've improved in that respect. And that's from just... Probably just spamming the uh, fireballs out. That's right. Fireballs! Balls of fire. Uh, missed. Oh, 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 and I rolled, and I did not play off very nicely. Jump back, thank you. And jump back, oh god. Got hit in the face. Oh! Seriously, the dodge is awesome. Fantastic addiction, addition to the game. Got hit him. Yes! Oh man. Ooh, I'm rating three. Mine's four. I'm saying that I'm beating these people and saying ooh and stuff like that, but they are rubbish. I should be killing them first off. I'm gonna go. Should I continue to go in this direction? Or. Ooh, there's another one of those uh, skeleton places. Graveyards. It's a very strange place to have a graveyard um, in the middle of the woods, but you know it adds to the nice spooky effect. Is this the same graveyard? No, it's a different one. Oh, it might be the same one, actually. <laughs> Which means I'm completely turned around. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm guessing then that this way goes back towards the city? Or city, the village? Hey, it does. I got wild turned around then. That's uh, not brilliant for me. Do I have a map? No, I don't. But I'm guessing no map yet, as it's still in pre-alpha. So that makes a hell of a lot of sense. I wouldn't expect one for a while yet. Um. No, I'm still lost. Oh, there they are. There's the two guards. So that means that this direction, you see that hut just in the distance there? That's where we're heading. If I can get there quickly, which I cannot. Wow, look at the size of that moon. It's ginormous. Can you imagine the friggin' pools on the ocean with that thing? I'm surprised there's no friggin' tidal waves. Jesus. Anyway, the water looks absolutely fantastic. Even though it's dark, you can see it looks awesome. It's a very nice engine to use, the uh, cry engine. Let's have a look inside. Right, so in this place is our weapons dealer who has a mace that does ooh, damage 11.3, has a blocking rating of 0.2, which is rubbish, but it's a mace, so who cares, and a knockback effect of 3.7, which means it's awesome. Um, 
that's alright, but obviously this has the extra knockback effect. See the blue right in the top of the mace as well? It means it's, uh, I think that means it's slightly better than other things. Or maybe it's just a way of differentiating, because this one has blue as well. Um, and I can't see anything good about that, so... Apart from the price. Jesus. It's a very expensive sword for what it is. Anyway. Let's sell this geezer some stuff. So, have that. Have that. See, my, as I'm clicking and... Whoa, 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 whoa. What did I just do? Did I just drop that? See, as I am clicking in here, my money is going up. So every time I place something in his inventory, my money goes up. And that's how you do trading at the moment in this game. It's actually quite nice, um, but it does take out a bit of the like interaction level. But obviously, once again, pre-alpha, so can't expect too many scripting items to be added just yet. So that has not got me enough gold to buy that mace, which is unfortunate, because that's what I wanted. Is that my shield that I dropped? It is. That was lucky then. If it wasn't, I do not want to seriously fight this guy. I fought him before, actually, um, and killed him. Um, but he respawned, which was scary, because I wasn't expecting him to. Okay. So I think that's... Actually, let's just have a look quick gander over here. I want to see what that little speck is there. I think it's just nothing, but it looks interesting. Oh, it's a person. It's a person. So it seems there might be some sort of docking area here, which looks quite cool. And this guy is going to be guarding it. He looks awesomely stupid. Hi! <laughs> he looks well depressed, doesn't he? Just stand there looking at the ocean. Nice view, though. Apart from there's nothing there, but it's a nice, nice, like, sunset y type atmosphere. That's quite cool. So, yeah, I'm, that's the. Uh, this is the second video for the memory of Elderim. Said it correctly this time. Awesome. And uh, I strongly suggest you guys go and check this game out. It's uh, in pre alpha. You can download it. The link will be in the description below. And they currently have a Kickstarter starting up as well. So, check that out if you really enjoy the game. It is a fantastic um, game so far. Really enjoy it. I should love just turn it on and going out and finding some people to smack with own mace and stuff so uh, yeah I'll see you guys next time thanks for watching